That's very optimistic. And there is also a lot of curiosity of outer space sightings, UFOs and aliens. So what would you say? So can we completely rule this out? Or would you say there are possibilities? We should be open to possibilities in this as well. Yeah, you look at the probability theory. With respect to probability theory, we cannot totally rule out aliens is not there. Because uh, even the discovery of water on the moon, uh, when we went to the so many instruments to show, because previously told uh, water is not there on the moon, but it does not explore the whole moon. So until otherwise you explore the whole moon, then telling water is not there on the moon, not correct. We have to explore the whole moon, then only we can tell. When, when we did like that only, we have seen the places where they landed and seen and declared water is not there, is not there even today. And where the places were not landed, we have, especially in the polar regions, we could see that. That means the whole system has to be seen before telling yes or no. Similarly, the whole universe, unless otherwise you don't explore, you cannot tell no. Uh, even for yes also, you have to find the difficulty. But probability tells uh, if in, the, in this our earth, the life form has come, the mechanism in which the life form has come, we cannot rule out the similar mechanism is not happening in the something places called exoplanets. We have seen thousands of places uh, where in the, in the whole universe, something like Earth, mm -hmm. nearer to a star, something like the Sun. Mm -hmm. So when here life form has come, why not life form there? We don't know. Probably life form will be waiting to come, or life form would have come and gone, our life form maybe still may be there. We don't know. But unless there is two, we cannot tell. So it, it is a, it's, it's a, as the probability is telling, it's a chance uh, we have to look for that.